Yeah, she likes it. <laughs> Her dry food goes down and then I just sprinkle on top, she eats it. Not a drama at all. I had um, one old, it was a really old poodle, she had some, she was a seizuring old dog, she had some arthritis problems going on and he popped on that, it was like a new puppy again. I use the, I recommend the rose hip bottle canine for skin for, um, and definitely for arthritis. But if you had a few skin patients, um, my other, I've got another dog that's on rose hip as well. She's a big great Jane at the front. She's got some skin irritation, so but I've had her on for quite a while. Dramatically improved the, the last years that she's got. I know she's old, I know she's gonna be a bit stiff, but she's perkier and she's a lot more lively, so I think it's dramatically improved. Yep, definitely. She, we go for walks every morning. I live on acreage, so we, and I let her go off leash and she smells all the rabbit holes and things. Um, before the rose hip vital canine, I, she would just, I'd just catch her up. I'd walk down and then catch her on the way back. So she'd only walk half the distance that I'd walk. Um, and then she'd just smell the roses and the rabbit holes. I, now that she's on the rose hip vital canine, I, she's actually ahead of us now. She's actually running ahead of us, which is nice. She still stops and smells the rabbit holes, but then she'll run to catch us back up again, which is a good thing because now she's still with us now rather than, because I've got two other dogs, um, rather than just being left behind and caught back up again, so. Uh, apart from the, just the um, better on the walks with her arthritis, she's not as stiff. She's just so much more alert now. She's, she's up in the morning, she's bright. You call her name and she goes, what do you want? Whereas before she'd be a bit duller and a bit more lethargic, she is a lot perkier.